what's up fam welcome back to the channel for another gta online video thank you guys for stopping by hopefully everybody's having a great day today a uh, really short glitch for you guys today this is going to be how to uh, get the fib badge all right uh it's it's just a regular like the fib badge that hangs from your character's neck you know kind of like a necklace um and i'm going to be showing you guys how to get that all right it's pretty easy to do all you need is the arcade with the heist setup okay you need to go ahead and pay to restart a heist if you don't have one going already and then once you've got these two done the scope out and the vault contents all right be sure you got these two done and then you want to select one of these either silent and sneaky or the big con all right either one of these will work uh for this and then once you've got those selected you've got your two uh your two uh setups right here done it's going to open up this board for you Go ahead and pick your gunman, your driver, and your hacker, okay? That'll let you start the setup missions, okay? And this is the one you're going to want to do, the hacking device. This is where you're going to get the FIB badge, all right? So once you've got all that set up, guys, just go ahead up to the board, hit right on the D-pad, and then you're going to launch this mission right here, the hacking device, okay? So we're going to launch that. And then what's going to happen is we're going to spawn outside, and we want to spawn outside with the FIB suit on, all right? Uh... If you don't spawn in the suit, then you might want to find a new session and restart this this step right here, okay? Because we want to spawn in the suit. Um, you might remember I directed your attention to some keypads when you were All right, here we are. See, we got the suit. Yeah, That's exactly what we want, them, okay? We now, we're just going to make our way to ammunition, and we're going to wait for Lester to quit talking before we go inside, all right? All right, now once we get down here to the ammunitions, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna go inside and we're gonna select the outfit that we wanna put the FIB badge on, okay? Uh, and a quick tip is it won't go on all outfits, all right? I selected a few outfits earlier, like some of the ones I have with invisible torso or invisible arms. Some of those didn't work, so you may have to experiment with a few different outfits. If you got an outfit that isn't too glitched out, that's probably one of the best ones to go for. Um, so I'm just going to pick, you know, kind of a normal outfit that isn't, like, really glitched out. So just go to your saved outfits, and then once you're in here, uh, just find the one that you're going to want to use. Okay, I'm going to be using this one right here, all right? So you're going to go ahead and equip the outfit that you want uh, the badge to be on. So we're going to equip this one right here. All right, now once you've done that, just make your way down to the marker. Wherever your marker is that you need to go to to, to get the badge, uh, that's where you're going to go to now. So right here, we're just going to make our way down there. All right, now, once you're down here, you just want to kill all the guys that are hanging out, all these uh, police and FIB agents, just kill all these guys, all right? All right, then you're going to want to search the body here for the uh, the FIB badge, all right? So, I think it's right here, all right. So, hit just right on the, hit around the D-pad to search him. And then you should get the badge. All right, there, there we go. See, now I got rid of our body armor. That's all right. You, you see, now we got the badge on this outfit. So, all right, now once you've got the badge on, just go ahead and make your way over to the FIB building, and just carry on with the mission just like you normally would. All right. All right. Once you've got the device, just make your way back over to the elevator. And you're gonna get spotted on the way out right here anyway, so I, I like to go ahead and just shoot these guys on the way out. And if you didn't already know this, um, there is a really nice spot to get rid of the cops right here. So we can just come right in here out right here for a second or two. And we'll wait to lose our wanted level right here. Alright, now once you've lost the cops, you're just gonna make your way back up to the arcade, okay?
All right, there we go. See, the mission's complete, and we still have the FIB badge, all right? So um, now all you have to do is go save it. Now, if you're saving it on a regular outfit, um, all you have to do is go to the, um, sorry, the ammunitions or, you know, your apartment, or you can save it there. Now, this one I have a duffel bag on, so I'm going to have to do the duffel bag save method. Um, so I'm going to be showing you guys how to do that right now. It's, a, it's the same thing you would normally use to save, you know, any outfit with a duffel bag. Uh, so we're going to go do that now. Like I said, if you had this on a regular outfit, you could just go save it anywhere. You know, your apartment, uh, ammunitions, one of the clothing stores. But if you have a duffel bag, it's not going to let you into the uh, outfit section there. So we're just going to go down here to the mask shop and we're going to save it down here with the duffel bag save method. And then, like I said, just get up some altitude above the mask shop. You don't have to be, you know, wicked high, but just high enough. You can have time to open your parachute and glide in, all right? So we're just going to open our parachute. We're going to get turned around facing the mask shop here. And you want to land just in front of it. Or I like to run into the actual hat rack there on the one side and then by the shirts. And then you're just going to spam right on the D-pad, all right, as soon as you hit, okay? Hopefully this guy's not in the way. All right, just spam right on the D-pad, right on the D-pad. All right, boom, we got it. See, we got pulled inside with the duffel bag on. That's exactly what we wanted. Now from here, you're just going to go to square. You're going to hit square to, to edit outfits, and then you're going to lose the duffel bag right for a minute, but that's okay. It's going to come back. Okay, so then we're going to click on the outfit that we had on. This one right here. We're going to save it right here and click R2 for done. And we can just back out, okay? Uh, now you'll see if you go back to this outfit, and equip it we got the duffel bag back with the FIB badge all right so pretty simple super easy glitch uh, anybody can do this like I said if you got the arcade with the high setups and you can do this pretty simple so uh, drop a like if you found the video helpful and um, subscribe if you're new turn on your notifications all right because we do the live streams Monday and Wednesday at 6 and Friday at 8 all right we do modded car giveaways um, so yeah come check us out and I'll catch you guys in the next one later